Back at home this morning, a team at the University of British Columbia says it has found a way to transform blood and convert all types into the universal type. If further tests go well, this is expected to improve access to blood significantly. And Laura McQuillan, that is very significant news this morning. That's right. This has the potential to end blood shortages if all goes as researchers hope. There are four blood types, and I'll walk you through exactly how the researchers say this could work. If we can show you the four blood types, they are A, B, A, B, and O. So you can see those dots on the A, the B, and the AB. What this method will do is it will use enzymes to remove those dots, those dots are sugars or antigens, and convert everything into blood type O. If we can just show you the process for that as well. It's quite incredible. So this is what researchers say will happen. Every blood type once donated can become an O. And the secret comes from these enzymes that they have discovered in the human gut can do this process. This research has actually been ongoing for more than three decades, but now they feel that they're at the point where there has been a potential breakthrough on this. The researchers are now moving to patent what they've come up with and also start clinical trials. But it could be some time before this is put into practice everywhere, right? across Canada, but the uh, researchers say it could be five to ten years in fact, which means in the meantime people still need to donate blood. We know that over summer fewer people do donate blood and there is an appeal from the Canadian Blood Services at the moment, but certainly down the track the researchers hope that blood shortages will be a thing of the past, Heather. Laura McQuillan in studio, thank you very much.